feel it. We're gonna get fire today. Hot and dry, lightning predicted. I'm rested and ready. Not the weed patch. If we ever need to build line pulling weeds, I guess I'm the guy. Pulling weeds again. Your talent is being wasted. You have much more to offer, man. Don't just wait around for things to happen. You've got to take action. You could be a great leader. Like Teddy Roosevelt. Some are the principles of fair play and a square deal for every man and every woman in the United States. That's the idea. The thought of the leadership website has given Leif renewed energy. He dives back into his weed pulling project with great enthusiasm while pondering his propensity to become a respected leader. As the workday comes to an end, we find Leif still at work pridefully pulling weeds. With no fire call, time to pursue other important matters, like the fire leadership website. Hmm, the Wildland Fire Leadership Development Program. Ah, look at that, a leadership toolbox. Let's see what's in there. Wow, a professional reading program? And leadership in cinema? Cool. The reading program provides a list of books in multiple categories related to wildland fire and general leadership, as well as steps to implement a local reading program and a process for suggesting a book for the list. Leadership in Cinema provides lesson plans for viewing movies and discussing the applicable leadership values and principles displayed in the film. What movie have you seen recently that provided a powerful leadership lesson? Huh, a staff ride library? I've heard of a staff ride, but what is it really? A staff ride is a case study conducted on the ground where the event happened. The intent of a staff ride is to place participants in the shoes of decision makers on historical events to learn lessons for the future. Staff rides are often used to enhance preseason refreshers and other training sessions. Tactical decision games? I've done one of those. It was a great exercise. It'd be way cool to do more of them throughout the season. And it looks like there's a whole bunch of pre-written exercises. Standard operating procedures. I think I heard my FMO talking about that. I wonder if he uses this guide. <laughs> that guy needs all the help he can get. Wow, a crew cohesion assessment. I wonder how my crew would come out on that. The crew cohesion assessment is designed to measure crew or team behaviors as they relate to cohesion. This tool can provide a place to start in determining the strengths and weaknesses of your group in relation to team cohesion. What is the value of assessing your crew cohesion? Briefing and intent. I hope the team from the last fire reads that. After action reviews. We do those all the time. If I ever need to facilitate one, I'll be sure to come back and check this out. Self-development plan. This is exactly what I was looking for. A self-development plan is designed to aid firefighters in planning and tracking their personal development as a leader. A complete leadership development process will include formal training, challenging field experiences, and your own self-directed learning efforts. Wow. This is great. I can really use this stuff. I wonder how it'll work out. I wish to see you act in the same way I'd expect any one of you to act in a football game. In other words, don't flinch, don't fall, and hit the line hard. Congratulations, Leif. You're well on your way to becoming a great leader.